My name is Dr. Vanessa Paredes, and I'm an orthodontics and a professor in the Department of Orthodontics at the University of Valencia, Spain, as my two co-authors. It is a pleasure for me to introduce our case report. A 43-year-old man complaining of a poor smile and snoring problem came into my office. He presented a severe brachyfacial pattern and his mandible shift to the right. The angle relationship was a full step class two with increased overjet and overbite. Several teeth had all metal ceramic crowns and he presented a chronic mild periodontitis. The radiograph show a narrow pharyngeal airway space and the presence of periapical lesions due to the mandibular first molars. How would you treat this case? A treatment plan involving orthodontics, prostodontics, periodontics, oral surgery, and orthognatic surgery was developed. The treatment plan includes three phases. In the first place, a periodontal treatment and lower third molar and mandibular left first molar structure was performed, and also the replacement of metal ceramic crowns by temporary resin crowns. Finally, a placement of three mini screws to correct the content of the occlusive plane and the curve of speed was performed. In the second phase, an asymmetric sagittal split osteotomy and genoplastic was performed to the patient. And in the third phase and last phase, the placement of mandibular first molar implants and the placement of upper ceramic crowns using the digital smile design system was performed. The post-treatment photograph show a very good balanced face and the patient was very happy with the results. The angle relationship was a class one. The post-treatment radiograph shows significant changes, but the right plate had to be removed due to infection. The chronic mild periodontitis improved after treatment and the volume and area of the pharyngeal airway space increased after treatment and the snoring problem ceased. After a 24 month retention period, the aesthetics and the occlusion had been perfectly maintained. The radiographs show no changes either. So, the highlights of our clinical case are Adult patients require multidisciplinary approach. Mini screws can shorten treatment and can correct occlusal plane counting and the curve of speed. Orthognatic surgery has risks. And after surgery, the volume and area of the pharyngeal airway space increases. I would like to thank Dr. Berbiz, Borja and Alvalad who collaborated in this treatment. And special thanks goes to the AJODO for granting me this opportunity. Thank you very much.